Hello and welcome back to learning how to learning what tools are and learning what to what they're used for. So, here in my toolbox we have an Allen socket, a Torx socket, a triple square. I don't know why. That, I mean, it's three squares if you put it like that. A 12-point socket and a six-point socket. You want to use these when the fasteners call for these. Once upon a time, my grandfather told us that, you know, you get high quality sockets because you know they're made well if they're 12 point versus instead of getting the six point, those are cheap. Eh, not really right. It's, you use them for the purpose that they're designed for. So there are plenty of 12 point bolts, which I should have grabbed one. You want to use the correct socket for the correct bolt. So you have 12 point bolts, you have six point bolts, and then you have triple square bolts, which look like 12 points reversed, and so then they should fit in there very nicely and very snug. You should have very little movement anytime you have a socket over a bolt, inside a bit, inside a screw or a bolt, a nut, etc. So you want to find something that fits appropriately. Because could I find a, let's see if we can find a six point that'll fit this. I doubt we can, because I don't think it'll work. Uh, this is gonna be way too small. I don't think I have six points this big. I don't. Because even still, I will do this, which is, that's like a 27 or 24. 24. So, 24 millimeter. Fits on there nice and tight. It's got a little bit of play, but that's not, that's not extreme. You just don't want it being too loose. Even this 25 would probably take it off, but that's a little, that's a little too loose. 23 would be not even getting over it. And that's how you would pick a socket if you had to pick one, would be what can I fit where and how much, what's the smallest I can go and then go one step up before it stops fitting. Um, yeah, it's pretty much just that simple. You just pick the right socket for the job. And then they come in, of course, all the different ratchet sizes and things of that nature. You can still use sockets with Allen or Phillips flatheads. I don't know of any other types off the top of my head that are at least common in Volk or not, not Volkswagen's an automotive. These are probably your three most, or three, five most common, which is, Allens are pretty popular on most everything. Uh, Chrysler, I believe, was the ones that developed the Torx, and they had it for a while, and now it's used by every bloody people. Triple squares are primarily on Audis, uh, Germans, uh, Mercedes, BMW, Audis. I don't see many on uh, domestics. I haven't, I can't think of anything that I have seen on domestics. Then 12 points and six points are pretty common everywhere, everywhere. So if you were to purchase a home socket set, you'd want to make sure if you, hmm, I'd probably get six points and then 12 points if you have to, but even 12 point bolts are kind of rare. But I, I have obviously invested in 12 point sockets for all sorts of sizes. So I got that set. This whole set's all 12 points and these are all the six points. So that pretty much covers it. I can't think of anything else off the top of my head. So thanks for watching, quick little video and uh, hope it helps. And see you in the next one.